What's up, y'all? It's me, it's your boy Asmongold, and today we're going to be talking about them removing Heroic Strike. Now, a lot of people have been really fucking pissed off about this, and there's like a website even about uh, removing Heroic Strike. I think it's it's like these uh, these this people, and you go to the site, and it's like a picture of like the tooltip of Heroic Strike, and it's got like the Titanic music or something like that going on, and so I thought it was pretty funny, but let me give you guys my opinion on it. Now, Heroic Strike... Really, removing Heroic Strike will lower the skill cap on Warriors. Now, the real thing that I have to say here is that I think that's a good thing. And the reason for that is that Warriors are very... They're very complicated. I, I did a count, uh, and it's about 9 to 11 different abilities that Warriors all have to uh, mix into their rotation to learn how to play the class very effectively. And uh, if you go to icveins.com, uh, there's a guide written by a warrior, Jalopi, I think. And th he's a very good Fury Warrior, and he wrote an amazing guide. And uh, if you guys uh, want to check it out, you should definitely go do that. It's on their website. And uh, it's for fucking Spider, are you serious? Okay, he's dead. Anyway, um, he wrote out this really great guide, and it's about a thousand words. And so you think about that, and there is a thousand word essay to play a class in Warcraft, a spec in Warcraft. I think that's too much. And I think that there does need to be a lowering of a skill cap of a lot of the classes because, especially like with the snapshotting dots and everything else, uh, it becomes very inaccessible for people who are coming in and they want to improve, but they don't want to spend all this time researching and like perfecting their rotation and doing all that stuff. And so they're underperforming by such a large amount it's really kind of hard for people to get motivated. And I really think that the golden age of like Warcraft, like item, or sorry, not item, uh, spell, like utility usage was uh, right about ICC and Wrath of the Lich King. Because right about then, like warriors had, uh, let's see, like they had Bloodthirst, Whirlwind, Heroic Strike, and Execute. And that was pretty much it. I think they had a couple of other abilities, but I might actually even be wrong with that. I guess you could count Cleave, but not really. And uh, anyway, so. It, it, and all the other classes were pretty much the same. They didn't really have a whole bunch of different abilities. They didn't have like 15 different abilities. Well, you want to use this one in this circumstance. Whenever you have three enemies, you want to use this. And, you know, it's it's very complex now. And it makes it very inaccessible for people to get into rating and get into, you know, all right, I'm going to learn all this stuff and, you know, all this other things. Uh, some people enjoy that. But those people are a very small minority. And I don't really think that it should be based around those people. Personally, I play my warrior about four hours every day. Uh, average, sometimes I play 8, sometimes I play 0. But anyway, I do play him all the time. And when, because I play him all the time, I know how to play him very well. I play him all the time, and obviously, again, I am really good at playing him. Now, so the removal of Heroic Strike is, it kind of sucks for someone like me, who uh, I have the time to practice and I spin like I can I can do my rotation with my eyes closed like literally I can do my rotation with my eyes closed so whenever I lag out at the beginning of Mount Rock every single week I'm still like top damage because I know when exactly to hit the buttons like I've got it planned out in my head because I've played so long but the fact of the matter is like that's such a small minority of people it should not be the uh, the mean that should be not be what we're going for and I think that the rule of like heroic strike and there are quite a lot of other things that are being changed. Uh, I, I'm very against the removal of meat cleaver. I really like that spell and I hope they don't they end up not getting rid of it. But we'll see what happens. Maybe they might uh, change it up a little bit. But anyway, that was just a little aside because obviously I don't really think a lot all the Fury Warrior changes are good. But I think in a larger picture, the move of Heroic Strike is definitely a step in the right direction in terms of making the game more accessible, more accessible to get into the more hardcore aspects of the game. Because if you want to get into the hardcore aspects of playing WoW right now, I mean, you've got to basically take a college class to figure out how to do all this stuff. And that's really not what a lot of people consider fun. And I'm really glad that they're kind of tuning that down with like pruning out the abilities. And we're going to see how that turns out. Now, obviously, it's still beta. They could still bring back Heroic Strike. And uh, if they did, I wouldn't be too uh, too upset about it. I'm pretty much neutral on the subject, but I can really see where they're coming from by removing it. And just by making things more simple, more accessible for newer players. And, uh, you know, obviously, in, in Wrath of the Lich King, there were good warriors and there were bad warriors. And uh, there was a lot, a lot less of a gap, obviously, because you know, I got fucking four buttons. Like, you just take your four fingers and you just hit the keyboard a bunch of times. And you're probably going to do top damage. 
And so, I mean, it was great. Like, I mean, I'd love to go back to that. That was awesome. But uh, we'll see if we do or not. Either way, uh, it was a lot more accessible. Someone could make a warrior, figure out how to play the class, and, you know, do all that. But, like, for me, like, whenever I make a new character, uh, I, I look on Icy Veins and I say, you know, this doesn't really seem that complicated. And then I see, okay, well, this guy wrote a book. So, and I look at his logs, and he's got, like, the best logs, and or, like, very high logs, like 95th percentile. And I say, fuck, you know, I... Now I've got I've got to learn all this stuff, and it's just it's very demoralizing for me to try and make a new character and like learn all this stuff, and it's just it's so much work, and I'm just really glad that they are I don't know like lowering it a little bit, but hopefully not too much. And there are some things that I am glad that they're doing, and there are some other things that I'm not glad that they're doing. And uh, hopefully the heroic strike thing will turn out well, but uh, if it doesn't, then maybe they'll change it back. Pretty much all I've got. Uh, let me know if you agree. Let me know if you disagree. But that's it. Thanks for watching and like, comment, subscribe.